Hello, welcome to guess the football of the series in which you're looking for the football from the five clubs that they have played for. And today we're joined by Captain Tom. How are you doing, mate? I'm very well, mate. I'm excited to see how I fare in the uh, guess the footballer arena. I spent a lot of time on TikTok getting fed this kind of stuff. I feel like I'm pretty good, but we'll have to wait and see, won't we? Mm-hmm. I'll fire you in with the first club oh. for this player. Go on, then. And we will start off with a bit of Atletico Madrid. Um, Atletico Madrid, who could that be? Let's say Felipe. Did you know Tommy's only goal uh, for Chelsea is against uh, Derby County in the FA Cup? Oh, is a it? A little fact, yeah. Not many people know that, um, but no, it's not him. And the next club we will give you, it's where we go now, it's the, uh, let's go for Valencia next. Valencia. Um, mm -hmm. uh, let's go with Arejo. It's not Parejo. Did play for Valencia, of course. Yeah. Um, Probably not Atletico, though. But he is Spanish, so, you know. Yeah. I'm, I'm checking off some of the criteria, just not all of them. Not the ones that we need. Next club we'll give you is... Let's give you Vissel Kobe next. Vissel Kobe. Oh, it is David Villa. There you go, top of three points. Oh, I could have I had think... four. I know. Either way, it went there. I think either Barcelona or yeah, uh, Kobe. Was, was, yeah, because I'd already mentioned him. You knew. Yeah. You knew. You... Mm-hmm. And then finishing off with uh, New York. He's also got Melbourne City, Raul Zaragoza. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And uh, Sporting Gijon. All right. Are you ready for a little slice of your first player? Yep. I'm going to start it off with a bit of Inter Milan. Not many players we... have played there, so, you know. No, it's not It's not called international at all. Um, let's say Raja Golan. It's not Raja Golan. We'll go next with Ajax. Would it be Maxwell, Tom? It's not Maxwell. Next up, we have got Brentford. It is Christian Eriksen, Tom. Yeah. Get him on there. There you, you go. go. As soon as you, as you throw in Brentford, it's... Uh... Yeah, it was... I was, I, was like, I was like, oh, do I throw in Man United? But obviously, like, if I finish on Brentford, people are going to be a little bit like, well, he's not that well known for Brentford. But it is a, a big red flag, mm. isn't it, in his career? That, like, you know who it yeah. is as soon as you see that. Yeah, I think the only... Other, yeah. I mean, you could maybe leave it till last because it does just stick out. So I think I did it with Curbs ages ago mm. and he didn't get it all. So that was quite funny. Um, but yeah, let's go into your next player. And we will start off with a bit of, ooh, let's give you Wolfsburg first, Tom. Wolfsburg. Um, let's go Woot Weghorst. It's not Woot Weghorst. Next club is Lil. Um, I'll go Thorgan so, Hazard. A little bit tricky. Uh, it's not Thorgan Hazard. The next club we will give you is AC Milan. Hmm. Quite the, mm. quite the career this player's having at this point, isn't it? Right now I'm like, oh, I probably should... They're, they're quite international, so maybe they're not one of the, the nations of the, the, the club that they're... That the mm. team that they play in. It's not... It can't, no, surely... It's not my nan, is it? It's not your nan. No, no, Tom. Um... Okay. I'm pretty no. played at Lille, didn't he? Lost Lille. He did, he did, to be fair. Yeah, yeah I yeah. don't think he played at Wolfsburg, though. I think he's only played at a couple of clubs, haven't he? Yeah, I think it's just Lille and Milan. And the next, maybe a bit of PS, I don't know, maybe PSG Youth seems reasonable. Um, We will give you as the next club, Nottingham Forest. Forest? Mm-hmm. Look at the 60 million players they've signed in the last couple of years. Yeah. Played last night, Tom. They did, and that doesn't mean nothing, Luke, because I don't have watched football in probably about six months. Or more other than highlights on YouTube. And then it's usually mm. just Harry Kane stomping people in the Bundesliga, except recently where they haven't been. No. What an absolute nightmare. Mm. You'll kick yourself a little bit when I tell you the last club. Yeah, it'll become glaringly obvious. Um, I am so stumped. Holy smokes. Um, I'll just say Renan Loddy. I don't think it's him. It's not Renan Loddy. And the final club is Liverpool. I'm not sure that even helps, mate. <laughs> I'm, like, I am stumped. People are going to be screaming at me right now. He must be playing for Liverpool right now. Maybe. Or maybe he's, he's not. Uh, he's not, so he's, he's at Nottingham Forest now, but he, he played the most amount by a very long while at Liverpool. Yeah, that's what... Yeah, okay. Eight, eight years at Liverpool. What on earth? Liverpool. Played like eight years at Liverpool. A legendary moment this person was involved in. What Steven Gerrard when he slipped over? Mm, no, <laughs> it's it's that kind of like kind of moment though. Like it's iconic. 
Do you think of iconic moments, Tom? They like last night be. against Man United. That doesn't. I didn't watch that, that game. Doesn't help. Doesn't help because I didn't it watch was it a. Again. It was a dreadful game. It was one of the most boring games in the world. There's there's one word I could say. There's a phrase as well. There's a phrase. There's a commentary phrase. And you Tevez, get this player. Tevez with his bulldog like approach. It's kind of like that. Yeah. <laughs> Something along those it's, lines. It's it's not a description of the player, but it's the description of what happened in the moment. I'll say I'll say one word, Tom, and you should get it from this. Right, go on. I say corner. Oh, well, it's not Trent Alexander Arnold, is it? It's um, what's his face? <laughs> Defoe Carigi. There we go. <laughs> corner taken quickly, Arigi. <laughs> Jesus. Is, uh... Yeah, to be fair, that's that, that's it's such a weird list that I just could not put two and two together. So fair enough. Yeah, thanks. For yeah, the point. Is, I'll take it. He is all over the place. To be fair, so uh... yeah. All right, all right. For your player, my friend, we've got to start Cuneo. Spell C U N E O. It is an Italian team. I think I think it probably gives you a slight, a large piece of information about this player. Yeah. We will say Quagliarella. It's not Quagliarella, no. Uh, next up, we're going to go with Regina. That's a team I have heard of. Me too. Let's say... Let's say Salvatore Sirigu. It's not. Good guess, but not him. Uh, next up, we have a team, again, Italian, called Matera. Jesus. Um... So these last two clubs are bigger. Um... <laughs> yeah, no, I've just literally picked all player teams in the, the fourth league of Italy. Serie B and C and D. Yeah. Let's try. Do you know what? Yeah. Let's try Benucci. It's not Benucci, no. He did have a fruity career. He's got like he Inter did. as well. Yeah. AC, but... Next up, we've got Empoli. But the clubs are getting bigger as we go. Hmm. See, I don't really think it mattered which order I gave you these clubs in. I just had to give you them in this order. <laughs> yeah, so he's he's kind of a, probably a big big club last, I assume, Tom. Yeah, yeah, I would, I would I would say that's a fair assumption. Yeah. Let's just try Zappa Costa. It's not Zappa Costa, no. Uh, finishing off with his uh, main club, where he is currently most known for, Napoli. I knew, I knew it was going to be Napoli. That's the weird thing with Empoli. It's that end of the country. Um, I didn't realise you, you were you were the um, Polyans. I didn't realise you were geo guesser Italian uh, regions. You know, yeah. extraordinary. <laughs> I only think of like Politano, but it's not to be him. <laughs> I think I've uh, given him to you before. Yeah, I probably. Let's try Di Lorenzo, Tom. Hey, for a point. Well done, yeah. mate. Yeah, it is That's indeed it. Di Lorenzo. I mean, there's not many to choose from. I think once you get to Napoli, it's just about remembering them, isn't it? Because it's mm -hmm. got to be Italian. Maybe it could be Raspadori, I guess. Politano, yeah, if you didn't think about his career. Yeah, yeah. There's not, there's not a whole kettle of fish. Imagine if I Napoli. gave you Mere. Oof, that would have been quite rude. Right then, Tom. Into your next player. We will start off with. Since you gave us an Italian team, I will give you Venezia. Mm. Bit of Venice. Let's go with okay. uh, Giovinco. It's not Giovinco. The next club we will give you is Spezia. Another. Hmm. Venezia yeah. and Spezia. Venezia and Spezia. Let's go with your guess and go with Bonucci. It's not Bonucci. Next club is RB Leipzig. Leipzig? Mm, you didn't expect that coming. I did not. This, I, I'm going to say, weirdly, Timo Werner. It's not Timo Werner. The next it. club is Chelsea. Chelsea. That's, that's bizarre, isn't it? Mm-hmm. I think it's Emerson. He's Italian. I don't know if you ever played for Leipzig, though. I'll say Emerson. It's not Emerson. And the final club is Leeds United. Leeds? Weirdly, Tom, you might get it off Spezia. That might be for you with the FIFA stuff. I don't even know what Team Spezia looks like, to be fair. Leeds. I'm guessing he's playing at Leeds now. Yeah, I'll give you that. Is Spezia of the Tyler white... A Tyler Adams? Oh, it's not Tyler Adams, unfortunately. Did play for Leipzig, of course. Um, yeah. He is from the United Kingdom, but he's not English. Oh, uh, in, it's not in Bula because he's French, but not French. <laughs> um, I don't know, mate. It's Ethan Ampadouf, the uh, the Welshman. If you oh, remember his... Oh, yeah, do you remember of course. His... I, the, Le the Leipzig thing absolutely threw me through a loop, mate. I do I mean, remember yeah, he had a card at Spezia. At Spezia. Yeah, yeah like that's a... what I thought. Yeah, yeah. I thought you might have remembered that, but yeah. Let's start off with... 
Uh, crikey. Uh, let's go with Corinthians to start. We will say... I did, I did get a five-point off Corinthians in my previous video, Tom, with Colin Cousin Richards. Okay. Um, well, you think it's him? Hopefully you've not given me again, but uh, we'll see. Who else would have been Corinthians? Let's say... Let's just say R9. It's not R9, no. Uh, next up, we've got Gremio. Is it Ganso, Tom? It's not, no. Um, next up, we have Internacional, which is the Brazilian. I thought that would be the case. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I don't want to make it easy for you by giving no. you... No. Fighting around Brazil a lot. R9's not a terrible shout, to be fair. No, it's um... not, not. I mean, you could just say any Brazilian, mm -hmm. pretty much, at this point. <laughs> You'd have a good shout. Let's try, Tom. Nilmar. It's not Nilmar, no. Uh, we're going to go next up, Cruzeiro. I do realise that I've just done basically the same career path with, with Di Lorenzo. I do apologise for that. But this this guy doesn't... The, the last club is not Brazilian, so... Keeps the interest, at least. I didn't um, I didn't choose their career path, guys. I just chose the player. I typed them in and just started reading out the... Let's just say... We would not have many once they came over. I'll just say Richarlison. It's not him, but... It's not Richarlison, no. Um... His final club, big biggest club, most well known for, uh, is AC Milan. Yeah, Good to know there's been no Brazilians at that club over the years, is there? Is it Dida, Tom? It is. Well done, Lee. He never misses a beat, does he? No. That's what why you got to give him. End. You got. That's why you got to shout out him and just give him a load of like low league team. Literally from Brazilian AC Milan, I've got um Dida. Like of all the Brazilians, it could have. Obviously, I think he would have been actually quite a good one for this series, Lucas Paqueta. Might see if he's got five clubs. Yeah, because I think he was. If he moves, he'll probably have five, won't he? Because he's Leon, and then he's. But he was he was Cruzeiro, so. That's... Ooh, Cruzeiro. I oh, know it's Flamengo. That was it. Oh, so, yeah, he's got four, four at the up. minute. Dead but, ball knowledge. Uh, How could you yeah. not know that? And there, ends of the row. Into your next player, Tom. We will start off with Juventus. Juventus. The first club for this player. Juventus. Juventus. The thing is, it's really difficult to think of someone like who doesn't. Like who doesn't play there anymore and hasn't played there and very rarely known for it. I'll just say Nedved to get us underway because I'm not going to get it. So I don't want to waste not, time. It's not Pavel. Um, next club we will give you is Bologna. 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 Um, oh, what's that striker's name? Bellotti. It's not Bellotti. Next club we will give you, Tom, is Napoli. Uh, what about Insigne? It's not Insigne. Next football we'll give you, Tom, is Southampton. Oh, uh, I don't want to get it wrong. Pelle. Pelle. Graziano Pelle. Graziano Pelle. It's not Graziano Pelle. And the final club, Tom, is Sampdoria. The other Italian team. I don't know, mate. Uh, let's go. I mean, it's the other Italian at Southampton that oh. is known. Is it, um, is his name Osvaldo? It's not Danny Oswald, actually, Tom. That oh. is a good guess, was that, though. Was that right? Yeah, he was the, uh, the Italian that played at Southampton. Yeah, he's another one. Um, yeah. But the one I was looking for was Manolo Gabbiadini, if you remember him. I do remember him. I was never going to say him, though. So. No. <laughs> I mean, it's good that you even got Oswald, to be honest. Again, another one that's really interesting career. He's got, like, Roma, he's Southampton. Yeah, he's eager Conriado of uh, Italy. Yeah, he's been about. Yeah, I'll give you the more difficult one just to keep it tight to make it a bit more interesting as we go into the final round. Uh, we'll start off with Dynamo Moscow. Dynamo Moscow. Let's try Victor Moses. It's not. Next up, we'll go Benabache. Is it Martin Skirtle? It's not, no. Okay, next up, we have Leon. <laughs> and just so, we, just so you know, I'm not going to give you this player's current club because I've never heard of it. And I don't think you'll have heard of it either. It's not... Um, just my... I'm going to say them anyway. Is it Wagner Love? It's not. No. Next up, we have Olympiakos. I don't think Michael Essien's still playing because he's got he's got Leon and Olympiakos. Oh, look but... at that! You're getting the information I gave you underhandedly. I wasn't expecting you to use it like that. Shall we say a bit of? Oh, what's his face? Is it Valbuena, Tom? Yeah, well done. I was going to finish off on Marseille. Yeah, great, great yeah. shout, mate. Great shout. I think you did that right, right order as well. I, I completely forgot about the Moscow, to be honest. I kind of just put it off Olympiakos, Leon, and... Yeah, yeah. Yeah. French player. I guess uh, Mvila would have been a, probably a shout, but I don't think he had Leon potentially, because he played at Olympiakos, didn't he? 
kind of player that played it. He's at West Brom well. now, funnily enough, Tom. Is he? <laughs> yeah, just signed for them. Into your final player, Tom. <laughs> right. We will start off with Porto. Porto. Let's go Casemiro. It's not Casemiro. And then we'll give you River Plate. River Plate. So an Argentinian. I think a big name Argentinian players. You know I'm going to give you, Tom, a bit of information about this player because I thought he was Argentinian, but he's actually played for Paraguay. Wow. That's the bit of information. Paraguay? But he has had both a Argentinian and a Paraguayan. Um, FIFA card. Yeah. Oh, that's annoying. You definitely know this guy as well. Like, he's, he's one of them. I'll say Barrios. It's not Lucas Barrios from uh, Borussia Dortmund. Uh, the next club I'll give you is Unam Pumas Unam. in the yeah the, the, the one with the Wait, what one with the puma on it. Now you've got me really stumped because I'm trying to think of a, a Paraguayan player and that's really tough. I, I I weirdly have him down as Argentinian. Yeah, but he changed to Paraguayan this... during his peak at FIFA. Was it Salvio? It's not Salvio. Good guess as well. Um, the next club, so I've given you three so far. We'll give you Bournemouth next, Tom. My God. This is a good one for the, uh, the comments you'll love. For the viewers, yeah. Because what we're going to do is I'm not going to get it, and then you're not going to reveal it, and then everyone's commenting like, oh, who is it? Argentina that played for flipping Bar uh, Bournemouth. This guy retired. He's still playing. Still playing? Yep, yeah, he's thir 30 years old. Where is he? I don't think the current club will help you. He's playing in the Paraguayan League now. Brilliant. Yeah. <laughs> I'll say... I don't know. De Santo? It's not De Santo. The final club is Roma, Tom. Roma. Yeah, this is where you probably most remember his FIFA cards. Oh, it's Turbo. There we go. You got it, Tom. There yeah. we go. Yeah, because I, I can't... I can only do it if I can picture the FIFA card and as soon as yep. I know... The FIFA card, I know that it's a turbo. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. So, a good one, though. Like, ridiculous career just going all over the place, really. Yeah. Um, yeah. All right. Yeah. I've got one final round for you, mate. So, mm -hmm. um, we'll start off with Barcelona. Barcelona to start things off. Let's say Gerard Delafeu, Tom. Oh, imagine if it was, mate. No, mm. it's not. Uh, next up, we'll go Borussia Mönchengladbach. Is it um, Andreas Christiansen? No. No. Next up, we have Sevilla. Ah, it's um, Luke De Jong it is, is indeed, the player. Mate. Yeah. It is indeed. Yeah. Just Great trying name. to trying to long it out by not giving you any of the Dutch teams, just to make it a little bit more tricky. But I also was going to yeah. give you Newcastle, and I thought I feel like that's one of those niche things that you all, you 100% know because it, it's great for Tito. Yeah. So yeah. It's, I mean, you know it the thing about Tito, Gladbach right? Barca is there's only Christiansen to stay good and. Uh, Luke de Jong so it's like once you give me those two maybe if you went Barca Sevilla then put in the glove back yeah but I was trying to give it to you in a fair order Sevilla was like probably third on the list of most prolific yeah clubs. yeah I guess so uh, but yeah I do win the episode Tom by five points which is not too far easy, no, easy, I mean, easy yeah, easy. few early ones um, but yeah hopefully you guys did enjoy today's episode make sure you check out Tom drop a like on the video and we'll catch you all next time